Hey, 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 what's up, what's up? This is Steven. You are watching Mochi Pop, so make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, and we are going to start a little bit news section. It's not really news, it's more gossip. I don't know what it is, okay? But I found an article and I thought it was interesting. I thought it was interesting enough to be able to share it today. And the reason why I'm sharing it today is I thought it was for anybody who understands the old school k-pop this might be important the first generation k-pop the k-pop that mattered the k-pop that paved the way to bts got sevens from before so um and all the other k-pop artists that you can think of now this guy is one of the first of the k-pop idols of its, its kind at the very least um and his name let me get his name but let me read this article first it looks like the citizens are concerned after seeing um recent uh visuals of the first generation k-pop idol it's been a while since he posted a picture of himself so that's the picture right there and yeah a recent photo of a first generation K-pop idol revealed a surprise transformation that has citizens concerned. Uh, Koji Young is a former member of the iconic idol group uh, Sitch K's, one of the most popular male idol groups in the 90s. They debuted in 1997. Oh, he's probably around Jungkook's age. <laughs> uh, Jungkook, Jungkook from uh, running man okay with the song school anthem and quickly uh caught up to hot h-o-t or hot h-o-t who debuted a year earlier and was the biggest idol group at the time such case and h-o-t both had countless passionate fans and there was a rivalry between the two fandoms so yeah, I guess that's, uh, yeah, it's just, it's just, yeah, that's just the group right there. Um, Koji Young was known for his voice, but it was also his handsome visuals that many fans loved, of course. Um, so this is him who was, uh, younger and it got the hair and all that. And, um, yeah, so there you go. Um, so these are the visuals right here kind of see how I look then and this is him now I believe he's on the right the former singer recently posted a photo on his Instagram with TV personality Ji Sung Ryu with the caption meeting after 20 years although coach Ji Young happily smiled in the photo uh, people couldn't help but notice how different he looked all right this is the part that's interesting to me because listen if I haven't seen a K-pop idol or any idol or any star or person in 20 years, I would hope to suspect the person to look different, right? I mean, to me, it's a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer because of course he's going to look different, right? What's the issue? He's older. He's probably in his 40s, 50s, um, probably 50s, I'm guessing. Um, I could be wrong. You guys can comment below. Um, I, I'm, I'm thinking that he could be around Jungkook's age, probably. So, the 1990s and 20 years. 20 years ago was only like the early 2000s. So he, I think they retired in the, retired in the 2000s. So, um, but yeah, this is his picture right here. Um, this was the first time fans saw his picture in a while since he had mostly been posting pictures of his son. Many of his fans were excited to see him with G Singh real and one wondered what they were filming for. On the other hand, they were also concerned about how much weight he had lost. So he didn't gain weight, he lost weight. Not that I would know, but I'm guessing he, his body type was just different back then. Maybe he had more muscles, maybe they worked out a little bit more back then. He was younger, he had more muscle mass. When you lose your muscle mass, after 25 um you have to keep it up um so either you gain weight or you lose weight but you have no muscles either way right 
So that's kind of how that works. So he probably didn't really exercise a lot. Maybe he can go back to the gym. You know, who knows? Maybe he can go to Jungkook <laughs> show, show for workouts. So uh, who knows? Um, here's, here's some comments. Um, Precious, uh, from Precious, I think. Um, let's see. Looks skinny from Michelle. Okay. Um, let's see. More. So these are all the comments. A long time no see, sir. <laughs> um, oh, Opa, why did you lose so much weight? Always take care of your health. Another comment. It's been so long since we saw you. So happy. Opa, please upload more often. Opa, you're so thin. Why are you so thin? That was another comment. Another comment. Are you coming out on YouTube with G saying real? Into the comments, uh, you lost a lot of weight, but you're still radiating. G Young Opa. Uh, and then another comment even if you lose weight, you're so so handsome, Opa. The last time he was on television was in, was in 2022 with SBS reality show, Same Bed, Different Dreams 2. You are my destiny. So I guess that's him on the show. Um, so it was this recent or was that last year? Cause it seems like people just didn't catch the Instagram. Most people watch probably view Instagram more than regular, regular television, I'm guessing. So maybe they just didn't catch him on the 2022 show. Uh, since Instagram is just more things that specifically women would look at. So maybe, t maybe they missed that show or something, or it happened before the show. Um, maybe that's what they're filming. Uh, but why is the news out now? That's the question. So um, after such keys disbanded in 2000, he started his own business and did not continue his music career. He got married in 2013 and has one son whom he appeared with on the return of Superman in 2017. OK, so it wasn't that long ago. He did not participate in the Sitch Keys reunion in 2016 because he wanted to focus on his business, which fans understood, but he was later um, caught in a controversy after it was reported that he was using Sitch Keys reputation and the size of its fan club for his company's visual marketing aspects. Yeah, I guess that would make sense, you know, but I mean, he was a part of the group, so it's not like he needed to advertise that much about from the whole group especially since he seemed to be one of the popular members if not the most popular member um because they're talking about him right now so he must be that popular um so yeah i guess that's that um i don't know what else to say um this is him right now and um af after they caught the photo on instagram and i think this is the photo from instagram the fans were upset and again not, not, not upset, just concerned. They were concerned about his health, right? And, you know, people make comments. They just say, oh, I just can't be felt differently. Look, I think they're just shocked how, you know, you haven't seen somebody in a long time. Maybe you didn't catch him in 2017. Maybe you didn't catch him in 2022. Maybe that was around the same time. But at the end of the day, um, um, when you see a star, even there's so many stars in America that I've seen after a long time. Like, oh, I haven't seen this guy in a long time. So it's like, okay, he's older. You know, it makes sense to me. Um, that's just the way it is, you know. I hope he comes back to maybe host some TV shows or do other things. Maybe has a business show or something like that. Maybe he can commentate on those business Korean shows if they have any of that. Of that I know in America we do, so <laughs> so if he knows about business. He could commentate on business. If you guys are interested in business, because uh, he has a business, maybe he'll be interested in some of my businesses. Um, I'm hopefully to start a lot soon. Um, and uh, if you guys are interested in business. Head on to my other channel called Limitless Club, and I talk a lot about a lot about uh, most a lot of tech businesses. I talk about for some reason, but just anything with the Forbes and the big companies, I think, uh, Disney, things like that. And um, you guys are interested, so but yeah, um, I'm glad he started his own business and um, he's out in the music industry for himself, and he made that decision. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. So make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, and we will have more news coming up soon. Until next time, peace.